So I just came back from picking up a parcel and then went for a bike ride, which is why I'm a little bit hot and sweaty. I apologize for that. I presume it's something I ordered some months ago that took age to arrive for some reason. Probably got delayed by a certain ship stuck in the canal. Let's open it up. Yeah, this could be easier said than done to open. Do need this again. Am I being stupid? <laughs> oh, I am being stupid. <laughs> okay, maybe I'm not being stupid. This looks promising. <laughs> it is. I was right. So this is a brick and order I made in January, I think. So the first figure that I've got in this bricking haul is this. This is the Poison Ivy figure from set number 70908, The Scuttler from the Lego Batman movie. This is the best minifigure Poison Ivy's ever gotten. She's actually missing one of the vines. She's supposed to be coming with two, but definitely a great find. Next we have Iron Man Mark 42 from set number 76007, the Iron Man Malibu Mansion Attack from Iron Man 3. I got this one in particular because helmet flips and the face is wrong the face is missing okay the other Iron Man figure I have I got in 2016 with the Lego Avengers game and the face places started to become a little bit loose the face being missing is unfortunate but what can you do it's brick link next we've got the Falcon uh, pre Captain America spoilers for Falcon and the Winter Soldier from set from set number 76050, Crossbones Hazard Heist from Captain America Civil War. A nice little figure, probably will be superseded by the Captain Sam Wilson M America figure that'll presumably be coming out soon, but still nice to have. And finally, a bunch of figures that I have really been tired for from set number 21304, the Lego Ideas, Doctor Who. <laughs> With one of my favorite doctors, of course, number 12, and Clara Oswald and a couple of Daleks. Some figures that I never thought I'd be able to get. Now he doesn't come with a sonic screwdriver. I don't know if he comes with one in the set itself. He probably does. But what I do have is a couple of things here. Now these aren't technically Lego, but they're from a sort of tie-in BBC uh, release with, with sort of clicky figures. I don't have those figures anymore, but I did keep the sonic screwdrivers. This is a classic sonic screwdriver and this is Nine and tens. I'm a nerd. I'm a Doctor Who nerd. Not quite suitable for 12, but I will see if I can use it. Oh no, it doesn't fit. It doesn't slip, slip very well. Oh well. I'll have to do something else with a sonic screwdriver. I don't know. Use a lightsaber hilt or something. So there you have it. That's what I received in my Bricklink order. Thanks for watching. Uh, feel free to leave a like down below. There's a subscribe button right next to it. And below that, there are comments. If you want to comment something, feel free. If you don't, that's okay. Anyway, see ya.